It's Joey with Dimes Elite, and we're back in the shop today. We're gonna put a Dimes Elite 2.0 crash bar on this 2020 road butt. Before we get into this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button, like button, and leave a comment. You got your Bagger 2.0 crash bar. If you're running on a road glide, you're gonna need our replacement road glide fairing support with the ARP bolt and nut, a 3 8 ratchet, a half inch wrench, quarter Allen, and a T45 Torx, 3 8 12 point socket, the uh, 532 Allen socket to get rid of your crash bar clamps. All right, to get started, you're gonna wanna go ahead and take your 532 Allen, pull the two bolts that hold the caps to your uh, bearing support mounts. Once you get those pulled off, just go ahead and set it aside. Make sure you get your left and right caps off. And go ahead and just push those fairing mounts out of the way. And then you're gonna uh, take a T45 for your stock hardware and go ahead and pull the lower mounting bolts out on left and right with using that T45 and a ratchet. Once you get that T45 out, you're gonna go ahead and use your quarter Allen and remove the top mounting bolt in the center. After you've removed that, go ahead and set your stock crash bar off to the side. And you're gonna replace the top tube of your stock crash bar with the IMS Elite fairing support for the road glide. It's gonna use a 5 16 18 ARP. We'll go ahead and pop that in with the nut on the back, get her tightened down, and you'll notice that your fairing supports will match right up to it. Go ahead and take a 532 Allen, put those caps back on, and lock it down.
After you've locked it down, go ahead and get your IMS Elite 2.0 crash bar. You're gonna go ahead and take a 5 16 18 center bolt, get the top mounted up loosely, and then just go ahead and swivel that crash bar forward and get the two bottom bolts inserted. It's going to come with two 3 8 ARPs in the kit. Once you've inserted those, go ahead and lock them down tight. Lock your center bolt down tight and you're ready to rip.